Hello, it's Muhammad Akbar Hussain again. Um, so now I'm looking at this very peculiar problem um, with this mount in um, continuation with my previous video about the error in the Skywatcher EQ8 mount. Now, as I noted that after midnight, as the um, as Orion Nebula and Orion constellation is crossing the midline in a sense that now it is towards the western sky and the mount has to point towards it in a way that the mount the weight shaft is now pointing towards the west uh, as earlier it was pointing towards the east in order to point towards Orion Nebula now after midnight as the as the position of the nebula has moved uh, on the sky so now the telescope is having to point in such a way that uh, the shaft is now pointing towards the west uh, and the telescope is towards the east uh, while uh, before midnight uh, the shaft was pointing towards the east so now as the after midnight as the Orion Nebula is towards the western sky and the shaft is pointing towards the west all of a sudden the problem is resolved now um, it's slewing towards the Orion Nebula perfectly however if I'm pointing pointing towards anything else like if I'm looking at the star um, like um, uh, Procyon, which is which is still hasn't crossed the midline or Acrux, not no, not the Acrux. Sorry, yeah, um, like I tried it on the Acrux as well, but um, uh, yeah, so like the Acrux for the, towards which um, the telescope needs to point in such a way that the shaft is pointing towards the east. Then again, the 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 problem with slewing is um, is the same. Um, that it's pointing towards the towards in the wrong direction, like I'm going to show you now. Um, so now it's pointing towards the Orion Nebula and it's pointing perfectly. I can see the Orion Nebula in the eyepiece. Now let's go to the star. So uh, let's select the star list here. Oh. Name stars. So if we go down sorry this way like looking at for example let's look at the star named Alphard which is still towards the eastern sky 